Oh, my little Harold. You have awakened. <laughs> Good morning to you as well. I have made breakfast for you. So please come and sit down with me. Yes, pancakes again. This time I believe I followed the instructions correctly. So it shouldn't be like the last time. If they are not to your standard, then I will make sure to retrieve something that you will enjoy. <laughs> it is not a problem. So tell me, how do they taste? Hmm? Mid-tier. I'm sorry, dear, what do you mean by that? They're okay. Ah, I see. Well, I shall retrieve a better meal for you then. You do not want me to. <laughs> My darling Harold, if your meal is not adequate, then why not? You are mine, dear. And I want you to have the absolute best. Eventually, I will make you the best meals you have ever had. But until then, I will make sure you eat the best. Would you like the same meal from yesterday? <laughs> it is not a problem, my sweet little Harold. There you are, my sweet. <laughs> now, come here. The fact that you are worried about me is very touching. I can bend reality to my will. And honestly, this is not even that much of an effort for me. To think that you worry, though. <laughs> it's sweet. Such a caring little thing. <sighs> Almost makes me want to lay in bed with you all day. Treat you like the sweet little thing that you are. Pamper you. Spoil you. Hmm. <sighs> My little Harold, your kisses are just as sweet as you are, not to mention addictive. <laughs> mm. uh, unfortunately, we are not so lucky today. I know. We have a lot to do, unfortunately. Yes, we need to make an appearance. <laughs> oh, my darling, I would love to skip it and just stay home. But we do have to go. My followers are all gathering today. Luckily for us, this should be a short meeting. But unfortunately, afterwards, we do have to go out into public. Hmm, yes, we do need to make an appearance and deal with that woman preaching about her God and the end times. That I was some mother of abominations, a whore of Babylon. <laughs> what a ridiculous belief. But sometimes I must remind myself that they are not truly able to understand just what I am. To them, I am the sign of the end times. While in truth, I just wish to repair their broken world. Ah, go ahead and finish eating. We will depart soon after you are ready.
Ah, everyone is here already. Hmm. Oh, now that is fine. I'm just astonished at the loyalty. <laughs> Your robes. Come here. Allow me to fix this. I cannot have you disheveled in front of everyone. Hmm. What would everyone think? Though, if they even think of anything negative about you, I would not be kind. To think negatively about my sweet little Harold, that is a crime. Because that means you think negatively about me. They will be removed from my flock. And, well, one of the worst ways possible. So, if anyone says anything, please tell me. Because you are mine. Understood? Alright, now we're good to go. Let us finish this, and then we will return home for some... well, deserved fun. Afternoon, my followers. As you all know, we are here to discuss the fate of one... I am sorry, what was your name? Hmm. Ah, I see. No response. Hmm. Fine, then. Keep silent. Just so you know, there is nothing that you can do to prevent me. You would not be able to even stop me. So just cease your attempts. Hmm. <laughs> I will only offer you this deal once. You do not have to even speak. If you just join us, dear. Join us the easy way. Do not make this difficult on yourself. And I will not have to harm you. <laughs> so be it, dear, calling me a whore and spitting at me. My darling Harold, please look away. My followers, shield your eyes. This woman has chosen her fate, just like the others had before her. She will just have to become part of our enforcers. Mindless, subservient, an ally for our cause. Oh, what terrors you will experience. Hold still, darling. Otherwise, I will just have to leave you a shaking mess on the ground after making you lose what sanity you possess. Begging for your life now? It is always so amusing how quickly mortals change their tone once they realize that I do not jest. However, I cannot allow you to become part of my followers. Not anymore. You had your chance already, dear. Pity you could not have joined us in the easy way earlier. I do not enjoy making my followers become so mindless. My supporters, I am done. You all may look now. Take the newest of our enforcers to the pens. Until she is needed, keep her there. Once she is trained, I will have her as my own personal bodyguard once we have her under our control. 
do not forget my children. Those who attempt to attack our sacred temple will be shown no mercy. Those who think that they can deny who I am will be punished. I care about our family. I care about those who have not joined us yet. I care about making this world better for us. Please understand this. This does hurt me. But it is necessary. Now, we shall head forth to the town square. We will continue informing everyone of what the new world will be like once it has been recreated. Shaped how we wished. No crime. No pain. They will eventually see the way. <sighs> well, that was an exhausting day. <laughs> it was a long day for you as well, I see. You look exhausted. <laughs> oh, come now. No, do not struggle. You need your rest. Just allow me to carry you up. There we are. <sighs> hmm? Are you upset with me, darling? You are. I can tell. Something is not right. Yes, I made her a weapon. But you have never been upset about that previously. Ah, I see. You are upset because I did it despite her begging for her life. My dear, the only reason I did that <laughs> is because I have to take care of you. So I had my reasons. I must foresee the strategies that others could use. How do you not understand that? What? You think that I only care about you because of what you can do for me? My darling, you are the one that I cherish the most. How dare you accuse me of not caring about you? What if there was a direct attack? That would do nothing other than upset me and cause retaliation. If the humans choose that action, that is on them. However, what could actually hurt me, which I will not allow to happen, is you being harmed. And I must prevent that by any means necessary. I am even wary of new followers because of the danger to your life. The larger our following grows, the more we destroy, the more of a threat we are to all of them who do not yet understand. To stop me, they could devise a plan harm you. Do you understand now? It is all to protect you. I'm glad you can see my reasoning now, at least. I do not enjoy such methods. I was not lying about that. Hmm. Are you still upset with me? Good. I would rather you not be angry with me at all.
Now, if you want. Would you like a bit of fun, like I promised? <laughs> As you wish, dear. Hmm. Now you look properly tired out. Come closer to me. Curl up with me. Hmm. You do know that I'm not joking, right? That I'm not lying to you. I would do anything for you. I just want you to feel like you are the most important person in the world. Because to me, you are. Even if you do not feel as though you are worthy of my adoration, I know that you are worth it. Here, allow me to wrap my arms around you, darling. Just relax now. There we are. Sleep well. 